The fifth myth of happiness is unrealistic expectation from others. And this is linked with where the unforgiveness comes in. People have un unrealistic expectations. Listen, yes, you may have some expectations of others, but the fact that you have some expectation of others does not mean that will come to pass. Because many people are unhappy because of disappointment. Disappointment is simply unmet expectations. The reason why you are disappointed is because you thought you're going to have A, B, but you ended up with Y, Z. You thought you are going to have this experience, but you ended up having another experience. That is why you are disappointed. My recommendation is don't have unrealistic expectations of other people. Be realistic. I am not saying don't hold people accountable. I am not saying don't expect things from people, but be realistic with your expectations. Maybe, like I said, you are thinking that, okay, this business owner, you are helping them to help make sure their business grows. Yes, the business grows, they are making money, but you are not being taken care of. You are not being, you are not paid more. What are you going to do? Remain unhappy? Kiss yourself? No. Move on and live your life. I have been in that environment before where I was working, I was working, I was working. And every time I was promised that, hey, everything is going to be well. And I was working. Money is coming in because I can see money coming in. But I, I get just peanuts. And anytime I try to ask, they say, oh, you are too young. Take it easy. Everything is going to be fine. I decided I'm like, go to hell. I have to leave this environment because I cannot be in a toxic environment and be unhappy. I left that environment and boom, I pursue my goal because I cannot allow myself to be destroyed by one person's foolishness at the expense of my happiness and my life because I have a life to live. I, ha I have a family to take care of. I have a community to impact. I have people whose life depend on me. I believe that God has called me for a higher purpose other than what somebody would do for me. What are your expectations of others? Make it realistic. When people don't do what you expect them to do, it's okay. Maybe you attended a, the wedding of your friends. Maybe something happened to your partner and you supported them. And your mind is, when you are in the same situation, they should come through for you. Maybe someone was in trouble and you assisted them. And your thinking was, okay, I'm assisting them because when I'm also in trouble, they will come and assist me. Then the thing happens, but they don't come through for you. You share it with them and they just rub it aside and continue with another conversation. You're going to feel disappointed. You are going to really feel hurt, but you have to let it go. Because true happiness is understanding that the fact that you did something for someone does not mean they are under obligation to do that same thing for you all the time. Because listen, it was comfortable for you. That is why you did it. Maybe the time that you are asking them to come true for you, they themselves, they are in a deep mess. Because most of the time, many people reach conclusion without asking why. So you thought somebody would do something for you. The person did not do it. Then you become angry. Then you start insulting the person. Then you say, I won't talk to this person again. But you have to first speak to them. Why? If you can listen, if you can sit down and talk to them and listen to their side of the story, you will realize that they were also in some deep problem. It wasn't intentional. They really would have helped you, but they were also dealing with their own demons and they needed deliverance at that time that he wanted them to come true for you. Listen, this is life. The fact that you see people smiling, you see people laughing, you see people rejoicing, does not mean everything is perfect in their life. Because remember, there are things people are dealing with that they can't share with you. Because if they share it with you, you will die instantly. If they share it with you, you cannot handle it. So they are just keeping it by themselves and they are trusting God. They are working on themselves to make sure that they deal with that issue. But here you are expecting them to come true for you when they are dealing with their own demons. Listen, my friends, if you want to be happy, 
understand that this is life. If you want to be happy, understand and have realistic expectations. If you want to be happy, make sure that you put yourself in the position where you have less disappointment in life, which means expect things from people, but be realistic. If they come true, hallelujah. If they don't come true, we still thank God and continue with your life. Don't allow what people do or do not do for you to influence your happiness. You want true happiness? Make sure that you have realistic expectation of other people and don't feel disappointed when people don't come true for you because sometimes they are dealing with their own demons.